Hello? Get crew down to the flats on King Street. Have I got a story for you? Good evening. There has been a horrific murder of a mother of two in a block of flats in Lancashire. Dan Watson is on the scene. Dan. Yes, thanks, Bill. That's right, we received some reports that mother of two who lived in these block of flats behind me has been shot. As you can see, the police have calling off the surrounding area while they carry out their investigation. The police are yet to issue a statement, so in the meantime, we'll just have to wait for this story to unfold. Back to you in the studio. And we're off there. Alright? Yeah, I'm alright. You? Yeah, I'm fine. Um, listen, fancy going for a drink tomorrow? Yeah, I'm free all day. What sort of time? Well, shall I pick you up outside the TV studios, say, free ish? See you then. <laughs> Great, <laughs> see you there then. Hello? Yeah, get a crew down. Oh, fuck a story for you. <sighs> Moving on to our next story. And we've just received some breaking news of a murder. I'm going to pass you over to our correspondent, Dan Watson, who has more information. Dan. Thanks, Bill. Yes, I'm outside the JG News Studios where a member of the crew who actually filmed my report yesterday has been murdered. The police analysis suggests she was hacked to death with an axe. I'll update you more about the story. In the meantime, back to the studios. Hey, hey Dan, uh, could, could you tell me, how do you keep getting these great murder stories so soon after they've happened? Ah, uh, well... I can't really say anything, it's pretty much at the wrong place at the wrong time. Oh, come on, there must be more to it than that. I mean, I need to take a leaf out of your book. Ah, it's a trade secret. And next, the news. Good evening. There's been a murder just outside our TV studios. The victim has now been identified as Catherine McKeever, who worked for JG News. Dan Watson, our crime correspondent, has prepared this report. I'm sorry. I'm afraid we'll have to interrupt that as we've got some breaking news coming in. Michael Smith reports. Thank you, Bill. Yes, we've just received some intelligence of yet another murder. The MP for West Lancashire was found brutally murdered in an attack which is thought to have been motivated by a difference in political opinion. The body, which was found the in bastards, I'll make some justice. ...is believed to have been dumped there for at least 18 to 24 hours.
The murder of yet another JG News employee has sent fear throughout the studios. Dan Watson is the latest victim of this vicious serial killer. What's worrying most people now is who's next. Michael Smith, JG News.